Hi, and welcome back to your MESE lesson. I'm Claire. Now that you understand the concept of answering questions negatively with may or might, plus not have to, let's really practice. Before we begin, let's review the conjugation that you learned in video A. Remember to focus on your pronunciation and conversation speed. Let's build a full answer with the phrase, work over the weekend using may. Please repeat after me. I may not have to work over the weekend. Please repeat. You may not have to work over the weekend. Please repeat. She may not have to work over the weekend. Please repeat. He may not have to work over the weekend. Please repeat. We may not have to work over the weekend. Please repeat. They may not have to work over the weekend. Great. Let's start practicing. This time, let's practice changing the phrase. Please read and listen first, and then answer the question using may. Are you going to have to go to the ER? Good job. Please repeat. I may not have to go to the ER. What about Abby? Please repeat. She may not have to go to the ER. Good job. Are you going to treat your boss and his wife to dinner? Excellent. Please repeat. I may not have to treat my boss and his wife to dinner. Good. What about Lenora? Please repeat. She may not have to treat her boss and his wife to dinner. Great. Are you going to have to pay more taxes this year? Good. Please repeat. I may not have to pay more taxes this year. What about you and me? Good. Please repeat. We may not have to pay more taxes this year. Great. Are you going to call Dan first thing in the morning? Very nice. Please repeat. I may not have to call him first thing in the morning. What about Mira? Please repeat. She may not have to call him first thing in the morning. Great job. Let's answer using might. Are you going to spend the weekend at your in-laws house? Please repeat. I might not have to spend the weekend at my in-laws' house. Good. What about Larry and Jake?
Please repeat. They might not have to spend the weekend at their in-laws' houses. Are you going to go to your cousin's wedding after all? Please repeat. I might not have to go to my cousin's wedding after all. What about Natasha? Good work. Please repeat. She might not have to go to her cousin's wedding after all. Well done. Please practice with this video until you are able to answer questions fluently. Remember, using the vocabulary to practice making your own answers is a great way to become fluent. When you're ready, move on to video C to test your progress. I'm Claire and I'll see you soon. Good luck.